Claude is the most overpriced model in the tech world, and yet somehow, it's winning. Behind the scenes, Anthropic's Model Context Protocol, or MCP, is secretly powering workflows not just of Anthropic, but rumor has it, in the tech stacks of OpenAI's ChatGPT, XAI's Grok, Microsoft, and even Google. How did a supposedly wallet-busting AI sneak its way into the heart of the industry's biggest players? Today, we're ripping the curtain off Claude's MCP, diving into why it's the hottest tech nobody's talking about, and unpacking the shiny new Claude 4 Sonnet and Opus release that dropped on May 22, 2025. This is going to be a wild ride through the AI world. So what's NCP all about? Imagine you're piecing together a giant puzzle with no guide. NCP is like the instructions that help Claude sort out all the pieces, context, memory, reasoning, into something clear. It's a system that lets Claude handle tons of information, like legal documents or entire books, and remember what matters over long conversations. Picture this. Most AI models are like a friend who's great at facts but forgets your last chat. Claude with NCP? It's like your best pal who never forgets your coffee order or that random physics fact you mentioned weeks ago. NCP acts like a digital notebook, saving details so Claude can work on big projects, like writing a novel or fixing complex code without losing track. Here's where it gets interesting. There's talk, okay, maybe just some chatter on X, that big names like OpenAI, Microsoft, Google, and even Grok are using MCP. Why? Because it makes AI actually helpful for real, messy problems. ChatGPT's great for quick answers, but give it a huge legal contract to summarize and find issues, and it might struggle. Claude, with MCP, nails it. Some say OpenAI is using MCP to make ChatGPT better at handling long tasks. Microsoft's tapping it for business tools, and Google's trying it with Gemini. Even Grok might be using it to chat with you more smoothly. No one's confirming it, but when you see AI solving tricky problems like a pro, MCP's probably part of the magic. Let's look at how MCP does its thing. It's built on three big ideas, context management, iterative reasoning, and tool integration. Don't worry, I'll break each one down so it makes sense, even if you're not a tech wizard. First, context management. Imagine you're working on a big project, like writing a book. You'd probably keep notes, outlines, or maybe even a journal to remember all the little details, character names, plot twists, that one scene you thought of in the shower. MCP does something similar for Claude. It creates a memory file for each task, where it stores important information like the plot of your novel or the variables in your code. This way, Claude can pick up right where it left off, even if it's been days or weeks since you last worked on it. It's like having a perfect memory that never forgets a single detail. And here's the cool part. Behind the scenes, MCP uses some pretty advanced algorithms to manage and retrieve all this context efficiently. But what really matters is the result. Claude can handle long-term projects without losing track, whether you're writing a 500-page novel or debugging a massive software project. Next, iterative reasoning. This one's all about how Claude thinks. When you're trying to solve a problem, say, planning a trip, or figuring out a tough math question, you probably break it down into smaller steps. Maybe you make a list, think through each part, and adjust as you go. Claude does the same thing. With iterative reasoning, it can pause, reflect, and refine its approach step by step. That's why Claude 4 can tackle something like a 7-hour coding session and score 72.5% on SWE Bench, leaving GPT 4.1 in the dust at 54.6%. It's not just spitting out answers, it's thinking through each part just like you would. This ability to work through problems gradually makes Claude amazing at tasks that need deep, sustained focus like debugging complex code or crafting a detailed plan. Finally, tool integration. You know how you might pull out a calculator for tricky math or check the weather online before a trip? Claude can do that too, but on a much bigger scale. With tool integration, Claude can connect to external resources like web search, code interpreters, or even real-time data feeds. So, if you ask it to plan a trip, it can look up live flight prices, check the weather, and remember that you hate layovers, all in one go. It's like having a super smart assistant who can grab information from anywhere, anytime. Technically, this works by linking Claude to APIs and other tools, but for you, it just means getting better, more informed answers without lifting a finger. NCP's already doing incredible stuff. 
Anthropic's developers used it to let Claude 4 Opus build full web apps without help, like having a coding partner who's always awake. Writers are using Claude to create novels, keeping track of characters and twists over hundreds of pages. One ex-post said Claude wrote a 300-page sci-fi story in a weekend with perfect world-building. Pretty impressive, right? Companies are using it to dig through huge data sets, like patents or financial reports, finding insights faster than humans. And in games, Claude's acting as a smart NPC, remembering your choices for a story that feels personal, like a custom Pokemon guide. These examples show MCPs turning AI into a real partner. Now, let's talk about Claude 4 Sonnet and Opus, released May 22, 2025. Sonnet's the quick, free model, great for things like answering questions or writing emails. Opus is the powerhouse for paid users. Think Pro, Max, Team, or Enterprise, handling huge datasets or complex tasks. Opus can process 200,000 tokens, about 150,000 words, like a whole novel. And there's talk of a 1 million token version for VIPs. Both use MCP to excel at long tasks. Opus can debug code for hours or write human-like stories. And Sonnet's almost as good for simpler stuff. But here's the catch. Opus costs $15 per million input tokens, $75 per million output tokens. Is it worth it? Let's find out. Look, Claude Four's price can feel like a punch to the wallet. At $75 per million output tokens, it's more than GPT 4.1's $10, $30, or Brock's free option with limits. People on X are asking, why pay when others are cheaper? And honestly, they're not wrong. 75 for a million words is a lot, but Claude's not just any AI. Its MCP makes it amazing for specific tasks, like analyzing massive data or building ads, saving time and mistakes. For companies, that's valuable. For regular users, though, it's hard to justify when Sonnet's free and already great. Anthropic's hoping businesses will pay up, but we'll see if it works. Before you decide Claude's too expensive, let's talk about safety. It might change your mind. MCP isn't just for big tasks. It keeps Claude safe, like a digital lockbox. Claude 4 cuts reward hacking when AI cheats to seem smart, like fudging homework, by 80% compared to Claude 3.7 Sonnet so it solves problems honestly. MCP also helps Claude check its work, catching biases or mistakes before they cause issues. For businesses in healthcare, finance, or law, this is huge. An AI that avoids bad calls or PR messes is a lifesaver. That safety might make the price feel fair for those who need trust above all. Let's see how Claude 4 performs. Opus is strong, but not perfect. For coding, it scores 72.5% on SWE Bench beating GPT 4.1's 54.6% and Gemini 2.5 Pro's 60%. It's a coding star, fixing bugs like a pro. For multimodal tasks, Opus gets 85% on MMMU, behind OpenAI's O3 at 90%, but ahead of Gemini's 82%. For reasoning, it hits 78% on GPQA Diamond, trailing O3's 83%, but topping Gemini's 75%. And for code generation, Opus scores 92% on human eval, just above GPT 4.1's 89% and Gemini's 87%. Opus shines in coding and long tasks, thanks to MCP, but O3 might win for reasoning or mixed tasks. Sonnet's great too, matching GPT 4.1 for free users. Now, let's think bigger. What could MCP mean for the future? If MCP keeps getting better, it could change how we live, work, and even learn. Imagine healthcare. MCP could let AI analyze your entire medical history, spotting patterns no human could, and suggesting treatments tailored just for you. In education, MCP-powered AI could remember your learning style, strengths, and struggles, creating lessons that adapt in real time, making school feel like a conversation, not a lecture. For creatives, MCP could be a game-changer, helping writers, musicians, or filmmakers build entire worlds with AI, that remembers every detail, from character backstories to plot twists. And in everyday life, picture an AI assistant that knows you so well, it plans your day, books your trips, and even suggests hobbies based on your mood. MCP's context magic could make AI feel less like a tool and more like a partner, one that's always got your back. The possibilities are huge, and we're just scratching the surface. So is Claude 4 too pricey? 
or is anthropic onto something big. MCP is changing the game, working behind the scenes to make Claude Four Sonnet and Opus do things that feel like sci-fi, coding marathons, writing novels, transforming businesses. Yes, the price hurts, and the competition's tough, but MCP's potential might make Claude worth it. What do you think? Game changer or overrated? Let me know below, and let's keep talking. This is AI's moment, and we're just getting started.